Heather with Big Hearted Breeders, and today we're going to talk about the Balinese cat. So Balinese cats are long-haired Siamese, and they're a little bit more shy than the Tonkinese cats that I breed. But the reason I started to breed them was because there's some uh, research that shows they have less of the feline D1 protein, which is what most people are allergic to. And so I've had some really good success with clients that have mild cat allergies to have a Balinese cat. So these guys take a lot more work to socialize. We work at it a lot harder than with our Tonkinese cats, but they really get there by the end and they're friendly and outgoing as well. We've got some kitties that are ready to explore. So you'll see that they're all pointed and they all have blue eyes, all of them. Um, we have different colors of points. These are what you call old style Balinese. So these lines are from Sylvia Holland. And if you go to a show at, with Tika, the International Cat Association, or with CFA, the, the Cat Federation, uh, Fanciers Association, you will not see this look on the Balinese. So you won't see these cats in the CFA or the Tika show halls because they've kind of changed the look of Balinese over the years and they become more wedged like in the face. These are, they call them apple heads sometimes because you can see, you know, the roundness of the apple. And uh, I just really like this look a lot better. So it's what I've chose to breed. And we've done a lot of work to find some of the more outgoing lines in Balinese because part of personality is always genetic. And so we've worked really hard on the environment, but we also work really hard on getting the genetic predisposition to being outgoing and friendly. So this kitty is still 12 weeks old. And this is your Balinese. Oh, if you're not biting me. Yeah, you. Yeah, you little stinker. You don't get a bite. So as a side note, if you do have a cat that's biting, one thing that you do to train them is when they bite, ow! You make a noise like their siblings would. Ow, 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 ow! And then they're like, ow, 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 ow! They're like, oh, ow, 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 ow! And he licks me for a minute. Ow, ow, ow! So that's how we train it out of them. Ow, ow, ow! Ow, 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 ow! Like, oh, I don't want to hurt my sibling. So they, they uh, learn how to not do it. So if you want to see, here's a Balinese kitty with the beautiful blue eyes and less of that feline D1 protein so that it's better for your allergies. This is Heather with Big Hearted Breeders. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, go give your fur baby a hug.